Welcome back to Capture Rapture for the 13th episode of Banished. Let's hope this isn't an unlucky episode for me. Alright, so we expanded out again a bit more. We're creating this beautiful little village down here. Secluded away from everything. We have a herbalist, which we haven't had before. There's going to be a gatherer's hut and a... Well, there's already a hunting cabin there as well. And then we're going to expand out here and have some fishermen. And look at all this stone and iron. This will be a really nice little village. Well, hopefully it will expand into a bigger village. And as if on cue, the rain starts again. I'm quite happy with my people at the moment. Occasionally I get quite annoyed with them because they don't seem to be doing what you want them to do. They would not attend to this pecan farm or forest, whatever you want to call it. So I have destroyed it. Um, so... Yeah, we seem to be doing okay. We're running a little low on food, but it is summer and we're waiting for the harvest. Oh, we've got apples. Awesome. A little bit late. We're not going to get too many this year since it's summer. But we have apples. We have a different type of crop. I really hope them apple seeds were worth the expense. So how's everyone doing here? So this is quite a packed house. Fisherman, a labourer, a child and two students, and then you got one labourer called Welly on his own. <laughs> Surely Welly should have a wife. So... The yields are looking pretty strong this year. I think we can turn this around now. We can make this a booming village. Just got to be careful and handle it right. Make sure everything goes well. Don't forget anything. Don't make any silly mistakes. So the gatherer's hut is being worked on now. A hunter and a hunter and builder are living there. That's brilliant. So I built a house here so that my people could be right next to the place of work. I should probably build a couple more houses. It's kind of hard because you don't want too much built up around here because this is my forest area. Obviously I want my herbalist, my hunter and everyone to gather from the forest so I can't knock too many trees down. But maybe I will leave that free and come down here, gather all this stone and iron and start building up a little village here. That would be brilliant. Because there's so many resources there. And maybe start going that way as well. But one thing at a time. Oh, we are low on food. We've got one food left. But they are harvesting, so that is good. Just in time. Oh, and I've closed my resource bar again. <laughs> uh, Alright, which one is that? That's the one. Just so used to doing that in Windows, just closing them. Reserve of food is low. Yes, I know. Do I want to? I want to harvest this. Really? Are they harvesting now? Oh, I don't know whether to wait or not. I really don't want it to snow. I'm gonna leave it. Let's harvest. It's going out really fast though. Let's harvest the apples. It's better to have some apples than let them all freeze and have nothing. I don't want to be greedy. So our gatherer's hut has been built. 
Gonna need, yeah, we've got another house coming. Let's get that up and running and then we can make our way down here, build some houses, put up a farm here and gather resources. There is a nice sense of a, a achievement and accomplishment with this game, when it's going well anyway. It's a bit depressing when everyone is dying. <laughs> you feel uh, somewhat responsible. Our food is good. Look, haven't even harvested. Oh, although people are hungry for some reason. Why, why, Reynold? Reynold, why are you hungry? Go get something to eat. Look, there's there's tons of food. That's it. I'm gonna knock this down, and I'm gonna. build another storage barn here I think it might be the problem that they have to walk so far to put the food in there and hopefully if they walk to here that would be fine and maybe another one here did I put this the right way? let's just make sure of that That's better. Alright, so early autumn. Let's get all our labourers onto farming. So that hopefully they harvest. Because look, they're harvesting so slowly. We'll probably lose most of our crop again. How's this going? Ah, oh, awesome. We've got this all built up. Right, so let's get a herbalist on. Let's get... Oh no, only one, one herbalist? No, let's get two. And is everyone happy? We've got a gatherer here. We've got a gatherer and a hunter. Two hunters. I think we need another house. Oh, look at the, the gatherers up. Oh, the herbalists, sorry. That's really nice. You got some sunflowers, some mushrooms, and... I don't know what this is. Kind of looks like basil. I have no idea. Things for curing minor ailments. So... Hoping everyone is happy. This farm seems to be so slow at harvesting. I am, I think, yeah, that must be what it is. These are harvesting a lot faster because it has a storage barn there, whereas these are a bit further away, so it takes ages. So we'll have a storage barn at each farm and hopefully that'll be a lot quicker. I think that is the problem. No, let's let's that'll be fine there because they start from this side all the time. Are right, we going to need more wood for the winter? That's quite worrying. Yes, we definitely need more wood. Um, let's fill this entire area. 
because we can grow it back again. Are they actually working? Are they getting anything? Our current season they have got 34 iron, which seems like nothing. And stone as well. Uh, at least we're figuring out problems and I guess that's what this game is all about, figuring out a way to make people work the best they can to expand and be happy. A merchant has arrived. What is he selling? Not that we... Oh, cherry seeds. I would love to buy a cherry seed, but I don't have anything to trade with at all. I have quite a lot of food, but I'm going to need that through the winter, so I'm going to have to let that pass me by. I'm hoping when a merchant brings like chickens or some cattle along that I can buy it. So, do I have anything in there? How much am I, is my trading power at the moment? Oh, quite a lot actually. I'm quite surprised. We can almost afford it. Maybe we will go for this. Let's let's put some more stuff in here. What have we got to trade? Pekin. Let's get rid of Pekin. No one likes Pekin in my my city. Let's give them all that Pekin. Uh, let's give them some iron because we have iron now. Let's go for 120 just to get this. Let's put another trademan up there. Uh, let's see. Alright, let's take a few farmers off. I'm not sure why I can't click this. I know I removed it, but it's still there. Alright, these are all done, so I'm going to close them down. Good job, guys. Let's put them on other jobs that they'll be useful in doing. Right, we've got enough hunters. We can have some more fishermen to help us through the winter. Um, let's see. Let's have some more miners and stone cutters. Oh, a physician. Is that in the hospital? that we don't have. Uh, yeah, I think we're okay. Oh, we can have some more gatherers. So we need enough farmers just to keep our orchards going. I think we need them to go through the winter. Someone to look after them, although I'm not sure, I'm just purely guessing. So, one person on there, one person on there, it's fine. Yeah. That's all good. Let's see our, our trader. So, let's trade all we have and let's see if we have enough now if there's a button uh, there must be a button where you can say sell all because doing this is quite annoying so we've almost got enough oh, we just need a bit more what can we trade Let's pause this and find out. So, has he brought the iron along? Yeah. 
so we got tons of beans and corn. Let's trade some more of that stuff. I'm glad this merchant is is accepting food because sometimes they don't. Let's see if we can get this count up before he goes away. The wood is quite worrying that it's so low. So we need this count to go up, hopefully before the merchant leaves. I don't know why this isn't going up. Ah, it is now. Okay. Alright, so let's see if we can trade yet. Go through this again. Sorry if you can hear my mouse clicking. Just want to get through this. Oh, we're still short. I oh, know. He's not accepting food. Ah, that could be why. We need to trade decent things. Um, right, let's. No! Ugh. Oh. That was a terrible mistake. Let's give the people their food back. Damn it. So we lost the merchant. We lost the cherry seeds, but I'm sure they'll be back soon. So let's take some people off of the trader. And I've only got one. So the gatherers should be gathering the wood. Put another little stockpile down here. And let's put the priority of that up. Because I'd like them to work that and then drop the wood off here. see what's happening down here. People are cold down here. Yeah, I really need more firewood. Damn you, merchant. <sighs> right. I'm going to leave this episode here. Thank you for watching, and we will continue next time. Bye.